Hello dear friends and fans, how are you all? I hope you guys are fine and doing great. Well, this is our first class for acrylic painting. So if you are a beginner and wants to learn acrylic painting, these classes are definitely for you. Here we'll teach you from very zero level to the pro level. Here you guys will learn to draw trees and different birds, you know, parrots and butterflies and all the things like that. And also we'll tell you about the different techniques of acrylic painting which you can see here in these paintings and in their backgrounds. And also you guys will learn to paint different animals like dogs, cats, loins and you know fishes and camels and all the things like that. Also we'll be painting you know seascapes and landscapes, beautiful lakes, rivers, mountains, trees and much more. Also, you know, sunrise and sunset paintings like these. And we guys will also paint flags of different countries, their famous sculptures and historical buildings and their monuments and, you know, different stuff like that. Not only this, but also we'll teach you how to paint different beautiful starry nights, couple paintings, figurative paintings, different different flowers and, you know, much more so you guys are gonna have fun with acrylic painting but first of all in this class i'm gonna tell you about all the material required for acrylic painting so just let's start the lecture and see which things are required for acrylic painting so first of all i have this acrylic paint set i have ordered this for the beginner classes this is an acrylic paint set of 36 tubes and each is of 30 ml and here we have some of the features like highly pigmented and 36 bright colors gloss finish and great light fastness and this is an ideal introductory set for student and artists so let's open it i'm gonna open it for you let's see what's inside wow these are so beautiful you know colors and shades different tones of different different you know reds and greens and yellows these these are amazing let me show you more um these are you know like this and wow you know beautiful reds and greens you can see yellows and these are really beautiful and very good for beginners i think because you don't need to mix the colors and make your own colors you can just grab and you can use on your paintings also we have here some other shades let me show you see we have beautiful blues pinks and browns and different you know variety of colors so i think uh, i think you guys must have this if you are a beginner and this is you know amazing set i highly recommend this to all the beginners so just grab your colors and start painting and you know attend our all the classes you guys can comment below that uh, what themes and what subjects you guys want to learn and we'll definitely make paintings, tutorials and classes on them. So this was the acrylic paint set. And next what we have is brushes. So here I have a brush set. And this is also very good for beginners because uh, you can have all the brushes in one set. Like flat and fan brush and round brushes and liner brush, filbert and you know all the kinds of brushes which are required for acrylic painting so must have it and also i have some other brushes like these which i have placed in glass and you guys can have these as well here i have also you know you can see uh, fan brushes which are very important for acrylic painting and also you know some round brushes like these uh, of different sizes you must have these and also you know some dry brushes you know which are very important for making backgrounds and also you should have you know different size of round brushes and yeah zero size brush as well which is very good for you know detailing purpose and all that so this is very important and also you should have you know some palette knives these are also very important and you will see how we use these to take the paint off from the buckets and acrylic jars and these are also very important you know for making mountains and stuff like that so you should have these all the brushes okay let me tell you one more thing that some brushes have their plastic body while some have their wooden one 
uh, although wooden one are also very good but when we'll soak these for longer period of time in water you can see their skin you know uh, their skin peel off because they expand so i'll recommend you uh, the plastic one the, the one with plastic body so this was all about the brushes and you should have these all kind of brushes i also use some larger brushes like these these are called wash brushes and these are you know used to make backgrounds and these are also very good synthetic brushes so you can also have these so these were all the brushes and yeah i also use you know this toothbrush for you know splatter technique and for making different textures and things like that so you should have one so these were the brushes move towards the you know next tool which is guess what yeah this time we have you know palettes yeah these are palettes you guys must be thinking wow what a beautiful masterpiece but actually these are saucers see these are glass plates which i have used for my palette purpose so you can have these and also i have this one but what happens most of the time is we pour our paint we mix it and use it and we forget to wash so it becomes thicker and harder like you can see this way so i have a solution for this and which is very good for beginners and that is this tier of paper palette this is you know very easy to hold and we have you know 30 sheets inside and and this is suitable for you know oil and acrylics and watercolor paints what we have inside is we have lots of glossy papers and you can see this kind of paper you know just pour your paint mix it and use it and just you know tear it off like this and just throw it and use the next one so this one is very good for beginners rather than these kind of saucers and different kind of palettes so beginners must have these this one is very good so what we have next is canvases yeah canvases of different size and shapes like round canvases and square mini canvases and of different different sizes and of good quality so you can have these kind of canvases for your paintings also i have another thing for beginners on which they can start painting and that's artist canvas pad this one is acrylic gesso prime suitable for oil and acrylics here we have some of size details number of sheets 100 percent cotton a4 size let me show you inside what inside is these beautiful sheets and very beautiful texture and you can easily paint on it and you can start your painting with acrylic canvas pad really good one for beginners so yeah you can have these or the canvases as well whatever you want so yeah this was all about the canvases okay now let's talk about the mediums we can add different mediums to our acrylic paints for different purposes here what i have is acrylic retarder and we can use it for you know slowing down the process of drying because people complain that the acrylic dries so fast so we can add this for you know slowing down the process of drying we'll also need some tissue papers or the paper towels or some you know piece of cloths and also a beaker of water so that uh, we can quickly wash and you know dry our brushes and we can easily clean them and also we'll need uh, you know a iron scrubber and a bath sponge and some you know different sponge like these and some like these like forms for different techniques and different you know textures so and also you know uh, these kind of cotton buds and cotton ear buds and these will also will use for you know different techniques and textures so yeah this was all about the material required for the acrylic paintings and this was our first class i hope you guys enjoyed the class and it will be beneficial for you guys don't miss our second class in which i'm gonna teach you that how can we make different colors you know almost all the colors with these basic five colors like red yellow and blue white and black so you will see how we will use these five basic colors to create almost all the colors and i hope you will not miss it so stay tuned see you in the next class till then take care bye bye thanks for watching